on a daily basis just things going wrong like client like not meeting clients expectations or like clients have different expectations than you or like the way there's time differences and you know like you're getting on each other's nerves and all stuff like that like What's going on guys? I'm not even sure if I'm going to post this video, uh, but a uh, productive day up until now and it's going to be one of them days where like there's no no like, meetings, no fancy meetings, no restaurants, no uh, top floors or hotel rooms or stuff like that. It is going to be one of them days where I'm just going to get a lot of work done. It's 5 past 12 right now, already been to the gym, done a course, uh, finished the where is it somewhere there finished the jordan belford straight line selling book really really recommend that it's really it's it's a lot like selling and persuasion and like how to really improve your sales strategy your sales script and stuff like that anyway back to the video uh today i'm gonna go to a meeting in horn got a meeting with like a client or someone to do social media for just gonna like uh Know, brainstorm talk about like different strategies that we can use uh, to leverage his social media he's an artist from horn local artist who's trying to like expand his reach uh, like nationally so the whole of netherlands so i'm gonna like put a few little strategies in place or systems in place to help him do that other than that i am gonna go to the office like bram Panier is actually based in my dad's office in horn which was just easier because like Having meetings from your own room, it's a bit like, you know, it's you can't really do it, it doesn't really feel professional. So I actually, like, I've registered Brand Panay, my company, at my dad's office, and then I was like, there's a few little small meetings, like through Skype and stuff like that, that I need to get done. So I thought, you know what, why not just do it in the office? It looks a bit more professional than having your bed as like a backdrop. So uh, we're gonna do that as well. Other than that, no idea what we're gonna get up to, so I'll just take you guys along with me. Right guys, first meeting place, and yes, I still ride the bike. Hello. Hello, Tom. Hello, Josh. Thanks, man. Done. Just uh, ran some Facebook ads towards his like his social profiles, and just showing like different strategies that you can do to like build your following, build social proof, and stuff like that. So it's a little later than I expected. So I won't be going to the office today. I'll just be going home and working from home, uh, uploading the YouTube video, and then get some stuff done for my personal brand. Got everything done and needs to get done. <laughs> Absolutely knackered after that. I, and like I said it from the start, like this is gonna be one of those videos where I'm just gonna get a shitload of work done, and there's not gonna be anything like fancy or any like highlights or anything like that going on. But uh, like two reasons why I want to show like stuff like this is number one, it's not all like fancy and not all like Instagram lifestyle, you know, stuff like that. Like work does actually need to get done when you're like trying to build your own business. And number two, like, yeah, I reckon it will be good to look back on and say, like, a few years' time, let's say, like, Brand Panay does become a successful business and, like, I outsource the work, get employees, you know, like, really build on it, really scale, then it'll be good to, like, look back on, like, the, the time where I was actually putting in all the work myself and doing it all on my own. Anyway, got all the work done. I'm actually trying out a new, like, social media management program called Hootsuite. So these are all, like, the the posts I've already planned in for the rest of the month. Just for uh, a few different uh, countries. I was going to say countries then. We're not that big yet. But a few different companies uh, all planned in for the rest of the month. And I also uploaded a YouTube video. That's all, I just uploaded a new YouTube video and another thing I've really been looking into is, hang on, let me pause that. 
is Tube Buddy, which is basically just like a way to look at all your analytics from YouTube videos, uh, see like what tags are ranking. So as you can see, like uh, I'm fourth. If someone searches for how to earn money by working less, I'll be fourth on the first page. I'll be eighth on that one, fifth on the other one. That's just an easy way to see like what tags are ranking. Uh, just more information about my YouTube videos, tools, uh, search rank and stuff like that. And this is actually a free tool, I've got it for Firefox, I think it's also for Chrome and Safari, but uh, there's a paid version, I've got the paid version, but there's a free uh, like there's a free version to start off, which is basically just as good. Uh, I'll link it in the description box down below. If you're a YouTube YouTuber or a content creator or anything like that, then make sure to check it out because uh, it's coming really handy for me and actually let me get it up. There we go, so that video, the how to survive the new Instagram algorithm video, uh, I actually like ranked or used like, all the tags for this video by using the Tag Explorer on TubeBuddy. And as you can see, I am first on like the page. If you Google or if you YouTube, you search for how to survive the new Instagram algorithm, then I will be the very first video to come. Oh, hence why that video got like 2,000 views. Anyway, takeaway point from this video is that like even though all these like entrepreneurs on you on Instagram and YouTube always show this like lifestyle of like the startup life and the own your own business life and it's all fancy and all like palm trees meetings and stuff like that. It's definitely not the case. Like actually hard work does go into it. You know they might do the hard work as well but just not show it and just pretend that uh, the hard work like doesn't exist but it definitely does exist. There's a lot of hard work that goes into trying to like build your own business. A lot of things go wrong, which like for some reason no one ever shows either. But yeah, like, on a daily basis, just things going wrong, like client, like you're not meeting clients' expectations, or like clients have different expectations than you, or like the way there's time differences, and you know like you're getting on each other's nerves and all stuff like that. Like it's it's just like a work in progress like stuff does get better and you get better you get more experience at it and like client expectations do get managed and stuff like that but especially starting out it's just a pain in the ass but anyway uh hope you got something out of this video a little bit of a boring video make sure to come up with a bit of a more exciting video next time anyway like the video if you did get something out of it comment down below if you made it this far and leave your instagram username in the description box down below and i will make sure make sure to follow you back anyway like share comment subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one gotta do what i gotta do